Have you ever heard of a client calling up a broker and saying this, I want to file a complaint against my agent. They call me way too much just to let me know what's going on with my transaction. Uh, no, I don't think that call has ever happened to a broker. This is Todd Stock with Success in Real Estate and today I want to talk to you about over communication and more importantly how you cannot over communicate with your clients. Look, communication has always been the biggest disconnect in real estate and your ability to lay out a concrete communication plan to your clients, especially sellers, will do more to secure great relationships than anything else you do. Remember that communication isn't just about communicating positive news, it's also about the ability to deliver distasteful news quickly and in the right way. Look, no one likes to deliver bad news, but in our business sometimes you have to do it. So when you're delivering bad news, time is not your friend. Don't wait, don't react. Gather the information you need, plan your delivery, stay calm, and address the issue right away. Do you deliver communication guarantees to your clients? Because if you don't, you need to start. They do two things for you. They create the proper expectations for your clients, and it allows you to time block your time for communications. Create standardized communication days and times for you and your clients. And for your sellers, a weekly phone call, feedback guarantees after each showing, and bi-weekly showing reports. And for buyers, a weekly phone call throughout the entire process, and curated property lists every week of what's on the market. And for both buyers and sellers, weekly communications on the next steps after their offers get accepted. Just remember, it's impossible to over-communicate with your clients.